Some of you will remember this thing. This is the Barahaw. So this was our 10 for 10s car. Um, Craig Tropiano from Griffith bought this from us a couple of years ago now. Uh, it's competed in a couple of drag challenges. I think the best we ever run was like a 10-1 or something like that. Um, good fun. The car is now back um, after engineering and all that sort of stuff. The original roll cage we had in the car had to be removed for engineering. So now um, it's back here in Adelaide. We are about to fit a Hughes Performance T400 trans to it. New converter, new tail shaft, shifter, all that sort of stuff. Whilst it's here, the car's heading out to the guys at Adelaide Motorsport Fabrications for a new bolt-in cage just to make it legal, um, parachute. Ideally, we're gonna try and get this thing down into the nines with the same motor, um, with the Trans Brake 400 from Hughes. We should be able to get the, um, the 60s down to, to help with all of that. Um, so yeah, there will be a, a few videos popping up over this one over over the coming weeks as it all starts to happen so stay tuned for the barra hall to come hey back hey guys so we out here today um, with the crew down at adelaide motorsport fab or admo fab these guys are looking after trops barra hall ute it's out here having the um, bolting cage installed into it they'll be looking at a few other little jobs for us whilst they're here just going over a few things and tidying a few things up, making a few suggestions to get this thing down the track a bit quicker for us. Man, this place is pretty cool. They're doing some pretty nice gear out here. Um, beautiful charge with some massive wheels. Their own Hanson Road hooker, which we've all seen on Drag Challenge and the videos in the magazines. Gen 1 Hemi into this thing. Poor old Rocket, daily driven, as you can see. She's a, she's a dirty old pig now. Good on them, but at least they're using the stuff. How good is it? There's some really nice stuff out here in Adelaide. We've had the, the ute booked in for the cage for, for some time now um, and our turns finally came which has worked out well. So yeah, so if you're needing anything and you've got some patience, these are the guys that you need to speak to locally here in South Australia. They're doing some good work for interstate people as well which is awesome. So um, yeah, if anyone needs anything, these are the guys to speak to. Follow them, look after them, support your locals. And... <laughs> 